Hey guys, it's Firefly Curie, and we're back with another episode of The Walking Dead. Now, we're getting ready to start episode four of season one. Let's go. Loading. Please wait. <laughs> oh. Here we go. Wait, what? There we go. We'll figure out what to do with you. I was trying to protect all of us. Holy shit! She's stealing the RV! I don't know much about you folks, but I can tell you as sure as the sun's gonna come up tomorrow. If y'all keep going on like this, and that girl ain't gonna make it. What do we do? Give me the gun, kid. I'll do it. To help find a boat, it's our best bet at safety. Okay, but we'll be in Savannah, and my parents were in Savannah. Okay, we'll look for them. I was the one giving the bandits supplies. What? It's all my fault. We gotta jump! What? No way! Ah! Shit! Can't wait for you to get to Savannah, Clementine. I got your parents right here. And you be sure to find me, whether Lee wants you to or not. Now, what I do... Who the fuck? I don't know. But I doubt we're going to be happy when we find out. Oh, Lord. It's time. It's time. Yes, yes, we know. Oh, episode four, and then after this episode, there's no more episodes, uh, there's one more, there's, uh, episode five, and then I do have the DLC, which apparently affects season two, if you play it. So, I believe I will be playing season two after... Uh, we get done with season one, but it won't be for a little while. Around every corner. Can't I just hold it? Just for a little while? We're getting real close to where my mom and dad are. Maybe I can... Not now, Clementine. Maybe later, okay? Okay. How's Omid? His leg's pretty bad. I'm fine. You're not fine. You need to rest. He needs to rest. Kenny, how much farther to the riverfront? There should be just a few more blocks up ahead. And there'll be boats there? It sure as hell better be. There'll be boats. Have to be. Have to be. It's going to be okay. Kenny knows what he's doing. What the hell? Maybe this city's not so dead after all. Keep moving. No one's ringing that bell. It's automatic. On a timer. What kind of church bell goes off at 20 past the hour? Someone's up there! Are you sure? I don't see anything. I know what I saw. I'm telling you there's someone up in that bell tower. Someone alive! <laughs> if I were you, I'd get out of the street now. I thought you said that thing didn't work. Who is this? Is that you up in the bell tower? Oh, Lord. What the hell was that? Is someone trying to fuck with us? It sounded more like a warning. Ask not for whom the bell tolls, 
What are you yammering on about? It tolls for thee. Oh, we gotta get out of here. Everybody, run! Yeah, shovel him. Well, get me. There we go. A little too close, don't you think? No, Ben, help her. God damn it. Not all. Oh, oh, give me a fucking break! Wait, where the hell's Chuck? <laughs> Shit, he's in trouble. We gotta help him. There's no time. We gotta go now. I'll be fine. Just go. Chuck, no! I'll get the door. You okay? Uh, yeah. You've opened up your wound. You're bleeding. Shit, it's gonna get infected. We've gotta get him inside. Clean him up. Kenny, how's that door coming? I'm working on it. I'm working on it. We'll work faster, would you? Won't be long before those things outside figure out where we went. You know they can smell blood. Let me see if I can find us a way in. Alright, we're gonna find us a way in. Just a doghouse. Looks like something was buried here. Fountain. The shovel is never not useful. I don't think I want to start digging up God knows what until we find a way into that house first. Well, at least we got us a shovel. That's a thing. We got us a daggone shovel. Be able to bust through that. The only am will be able to bust through that. The only am will be able to bust through that. No way we're gonna force that open, not without making a lot of noise at least. Hmm. You think maybe someone's still inside? Nah, we'd have heard from him by now, all the racket we're making. But whoever was here did a pretty good job fortifying it. Nice place to hole up. We can just figure out how to get in. Hey, how you holding up, man? Lee, I appreciate the interest. But I don't think talking about my feelings right now is going to help us get inside this house. I think I'll go have a look around. Dead people saw us come back here? Are they going to find us? Try not to worry. Either if they 
they saw us, they can't get in here. We did. Why can't they? We're a lot smarter than they are. They're just like dumb animals. Mm -hmm. They can't open doors. We used to have a pet hamster. One night, he figured out how to open the door to his cage. And when we woke up, he'd eaten half a box of cookies. I don't think this is quite the same, Clem. Yeah, right. This time, we're the cookies. Just stay mm -hmm. away from the Clem. cookies. See about getting us inside the house. How's he looking? I'm all right. You're not all right. You've reopened your wound, you're losing blood, and God only knows what might have gotten in there. It could be infected, it could be... No offense, but you really need to work on your bedside manner. Try not to worry. It always looks worse than it really is. Except when it's a bite. Yeah, well, it's not a bite. We're gonna get you fixed up. Just get us inside the house, will you? I'm on it. Lee? Yeah? Thanks. No problem. Gotta reassure. I don't think I want to start digging up God knows what until we find our way into that house first. Just a doghouse. What else am I supposed to do? Ben. About what happened back there on the street. I know. I don't know what happened. I just froze up. Hasn't that ever happened to you? Just hear what I'm saying to you. You put that girl in danger again. It won't be walkers you have to worry about. I hear you. How do you think Kenny's holding up? I don't know. It's, it's like all he can think about is finding a boat. He definitely doesn't want to talk about Katja and Duck. At least not with me. Maybe we should just let him deal with it in his own way. Think we can get in through one of these windows? Man, I don't think so. Whoever owned this place had them all barred up. Yeah, uh. looks pretty solid. I'm gonna go check things out. All right. All right, so we've... Okay. Making I don't... any progress on that door? Guess not. I don't see, like... Not thirsty enough to drink that yet. Will we be inside soon? Yeah, not much longer now. I hope so. It's getting cold out here. It is. How you guys doing? Not great, so long as we're stuck out here. Will you please go figure out a way to get us inside? I'm trying. I, I don't know what else to do. I really don't know what else to do. No way I'm going to be able to bust through that. What's this? Looks like there's some kind of pet door here. I tried it already. That's locked too. Who the hell ever heard of a locked doggy door? I have. My neighbor had one just like that. It's it's radio controlled. The dog wears a collar with a chip in it, so the door only opens when the dog gets close to it. Bullshit. Every day's a school day. All right, so where's the dog? All right, now we can. Hey, be careful. Digging up dead things isn't what it used to be, you know what I mean? Yeah, I hear you. What's buried down there? Nothing. Clem, go over and sit with Krista and Obi, okay? But I want to... Just do what I say, okay? I'm sorry you hurt your feelings, Clem, but... Oh, God, the smell. <clears throat> I can't get it off. 
Oh, okay, that is not cool. Jesus. Are you okay? I'm fine, honey. It's just the smell. Are you sure you're... I said I'm fine, okay? She's fine, okay? She's fine. Nothing. Yes! God damn! Yay! You see anything in there? No. Looks like it's been empty a while. Whatever you're gonna do, do it fast. Okay, let me see if I can reach up in there. Be careful, man. No good, I can't get it. Here, let me try. I think I can. Clem, are you okay? Say something. Ta -da! Good work, Clem. But don't go shooting off like that without asking first, okay? I was just trying to help. I know. You did good. You just had me worried there for a minute. Can we maybe have this conversation inside? My leg's starting to hurt like hell. Gentle warning. Don't need to okay fly off here. the handle. Everybody in. <sighs> this is a big house. This is a very big house. Uh, sorry, sorry. No, it's okay. I'm good. I feel better already just being off my feet. Thanks, babe. So, when were you going to tell us about the radio? Tell you what? That it's working. That there's someone else on the other end of that thing. You didn't think that might have been worth sharing with the rest of us? I was gonna tell you. Kenny and I only found out yesterday. So both of you were keeping it from the rest of us. Great. Who gives a shit about the damn radio? I'm more worried about whoever it was out there ringing that bell and bringing the dead down on top of us. It's like they didn't want us to make it to the river. What makes you think it's not the same person? Whoever was on the radio was close enough to see us in the street, and we didn't see anyone else other than the guy in the bell tower. Because that doesn't make a lick of damn sense. Why would they bring out the dead like that and then try to warn us about it? He's got a point. How much sense does anything make anymore? In case you haven't noticed, there's a lot of twisted folks out there these days. At least the dead don't play games with you. Whoever it was, seems like they're following us. I don't like being followed. All the more reason to get on a damn boat where we can't be followed. I'm not going back out there anytime soon. Omid needs to rest. I think we could all use a little time to rest up and gather our thoughts, Kitty. At least until those walkers outside wander off and Omid's feeling better. He best feel better quick. I ain't gonna wait around here too long. Hmm. <sighs> Place seems secure at least. I'll feel better when we know that for sure. We need to check the whole house. <coughs> All right, fine. You and me will take the upstairs. Lee, you've got down here. Make sure you check every door. Understand? Okay. All right, let's go check every door. Is there anything I can do? Thanks. I got it. Hang out with Chris and Omid until I get back. Okay. Lee. I'm sorry. What for? <coughs> Going through the door like that without checking first? I guess that was pretty dumb, huh? Just ask me first the next time you're gonna outsmart all the grown-ups, okay? <laughs> okay. Oh, Clam. All empty. So that's empty. Nothing. Water's off. Alright. <coughs> I'm not that hungry. Besides, I need to 
you finish checking the downstairs. All right, first let's uh, make sure we got everything. That's the door we came through. Doesn't look like nothing's in the cabinets. Let's walk this way. Probably not the best idea right now. We need to stay frosty. Look at the table. Looks expensive and heavy. Doubt any looters would be able to haul that thing too far. The paintings. Not exactly my style. Bathroom. In here. Let's check on these. Hey guys. How's the house looking? Not done searching the first floor yet. But so far, so good. How's that couch treating you, Omi? Leg feeling better yet? I'm all right. I feel you. Finding this house was a hell of a stroke of luck. I like it a lot better when we know for sure it's safe. I'll make sure. But right now it feels like just the break we needed. Maybe our luck's starting to turn around. I Maybe. I I, I hope I, I hope so. What do you guys think about this plan of Kitty's? The guy's losing it. Look, Lee, I know he's your friend and all, but you need to be careful. That man is on the edge, and I don't know if I want to be around when he goes over it. Kenny's solid. He's just been through a lot, that's all. I hope you're right. For all our sakes. Sit tight. I'll keep checking the first floor to make sure it's safe. Thanks, Lee. We need to talk to Clem. Holding up okay? I hope this house is safe. Have you checked all the rooms to make sure? No, but I'll take care of it. Alright. Let's make sure that this door is safe. Alright, get the gun out. Just to be careful and open and anything? Nothing. All right. All good. clear in here. Good. There's one more to check. Oh God. Why is that? Why does that seem so ominous? Just one more to check. Jesus. What? What happened? It's nothing. Just nothing. Well, <sighs> things ain't got much. We should be okay here for a while. At least until it quiets down outside. Good. Thanks. Is he okay? Yeah, for now. But I'm really worried his leg might have gotten infected. Don't suppose you turned up any meds while you were poking around? Uh, just dog food. And there's some whiskey in the back. I was just asking Clementine if she knows who the man on her radio is. It's okay, honey. You can tell us. Who is he? What does he want? Go ahead, Clem. It's okay. You're not in any trouble. It's just a friend. I don't think he wants to hurt us. What has he been saying to you? What have you been saying to him? I told him I was trying to find my parents and that they were in Savannah. He really seems nice. I think he wants to help me find them. Clementine, honey, trust me, that's not what he wants. He... Lee? Uh-oh. Lee, you need to get up here now. What's wrong? It's Kenny. Kenny said he thought he heard something. 
to go look. He's up there? I can't get him to come down. Ah, oh, shit. Stay here. Alright, let's go up. Let's find out what... What's holding Kenny up. And we'll find out next time on The Walking Dead. So remember guys, be good, stay safe, but always have fun, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye.